Today is all about morning routines. Mm. Th those are the things you do every morning to get ready. Like, after I wake up, I like to have a nice big bowl of oatmeal. Oh, and the first thing I do in the morning is practice blowing my horn. What? Which, <coughs> <that's funny>. yeah. <sighs> Which is why the second thing I do is this. Huh. Stick around for more morning routines on Sesame Street. L what was that? Like Elmo 
the charger the other one, two, three, four, five times that Crystal woke Elmo up. Oh, okay. Sorry. That's okay. <clears throat> Good night. for you yesterday. Oh, well, I have a new morning routine, so today I'm ready to play. <laughs> yesterday, people playing catch without a ball. Today, a ball playing catch without people. <laughs> I wouldn't live anywhere else. <laughs> Hi, Nina. Oh, Crystal, you made it. Yep, I did. I'm ready because I remembered my morning routine. Now, come on, let's play. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Wait a minute. Where's Elmo? <laughs> Did you see anything? Oh, he looks asleep. He'll never get out to play now. Huh? Yes, he will. Wake him up. Yeah. Wake up! Uh, 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 uh. Crystal? Behind you! Come out and play! Uh, okay. Emma will be ready. Uh... Just remember, wake up. Potty time, eat and brush. Uh, okay. Emma's coming. Emma's coming. Okay, potty. Oh, breakfast, breakfast. Okay. Uh, oh, teeth, teeth, of course. Teeth, it's very important. Oh, change right.
my hands when I'm done. Next, it's time for breakfast. Max and I like plum and yogurt. Breakfast gives me lots of energy for school. I wash my face and brush my teeth. Next, it's time to get dressed. Mommy helps me pick out my clothes for school, but I'm big enough to dress myself. Then Mommy does my hair. She's really fast at braiding. My job is to hold the elastics for when she's done. I like to help. Now all I need is my backpack and I'm ready to go. Welcome to school with my best friend Shay. Hi Shay. Hugs and kisses. Have a good day at school. I love you. Bye. The letter. He observes. Oh, oh. No. Oh, no. Ah! He questions. Hapa what? He investigates. Hmm. What does this button do? Super Grover 2.0. He shows up. At a beauty parlor in a bustling metropolis, one cow has gone a step too far. Ma'am. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, I just had my hair done and now I've got a big problem. Wait! Do not tell me! You wanted to be a brunette instead of a blonde. Uh, no. Unhappy with your highlights? No! The problem is, I can't get down from here. You see, I'm a cow and cows can't walk downstairs. That is no problem! If you cannot walk down, then do what we superheroes do. Oh, what's that? We dance down! Hit it! Oh. This way! Oh, oh, oh. Okay, stop, stop, stop! What, 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 what? Is something wrong, my little Dairy Queen? Cows can't dance either. Oh, I see. You are a heifer, not a hoofer. But no worries, for I will find a solution to your problem. Stand back as I unleash my power of observation! I see that you are up there and you want to get down there, but these stairs are in the way. Hmm. Right. So the question is, how do we get the cow down without using these stairs? That's the question, Super Grover. It is time to unleash the power of investigation. <gasps> what are you gonna do? I'm gonna get rid of the stairs. What? How? By using my super stair eradicating hand chop. Hi! <laughs> Ow! Oh! I am now observing that these stairs are very hard. Oh! Oh no! Oh, how will I ever get down from here? Oh. If I cannot get rid of these stairs. Perhaps you can jump over these stairs. But the ground, it's so hard, I'll ruin my pedicure. Do not despair, my bovine beauty, for it is time to unleash the power of technology. And voila! A trampoline? Yes, something. 
something soft and springy for you to land on. Now jump over the stairs. Okay, here goes. Well, that was quite the milkshake. Oh, no, I'm right back where I started. Oh, this is hopeless. I, Super Grover 2.0, do not know the meaning of the word hopeless. What does it mean? It means there's no hope. I'll never get down. Ah, nonsense. We must not give up, ever. Let me just take a closer look at these stairs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. With my supervision, I observe these stairs are very bumpy. That's the problem. I don't do bumps. Then we must debumpify these stairs. Let me just check my utility sock. Mm -hmm. ah. Luckily, I have brought my super stair debumpifier. You mean that board? Yes, it is perfectly smooth and straight. Not the bump on it. There. Ah, just put one dainty hoof in front of the other. I'll try. You will be home on the range in no time. Oh, no. I still can't get down from here. You are heavier than I thought. Back up, back up, back up. Oh. Ah! Oh, I think you just made a ramp, Super Grover. Uh, what? A ramp. It's a sloping surface that goes from high to low. Oh, I think I can go down the ramp. Really? Well, let me give it a try. <laughs> it's working. I'm walking down the ramp. Oh, thank you, Super Grover. Ouch! Do not mention it. And so our superhero learned that you can use a ramp instead of going downstairs. Watch it! Talk about learning the hard way. <sighs> yum, 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 dum, dee, dee, dum. How many cookies are there today? Yum, 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 dum, dee, 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 dum. How many cookies dum, today? Dum. While they still baking, bake, 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 bake. let's do some shaking. Shake, 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 shake. Bake, 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 bake. Shake, shake. How many cookies today? They still bake it. Bake, 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 bake. Let's do some more shaking. Shake, 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 shake. Bake, 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 bake. Shake, shake. How many cookies today? Me think they're ready. Everybody steady. Four. Cookies. Nom, 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 nom,
wondering about today. Wait, what? <laughs> morning routines. You know, the things you do every morning to get ready oh, for yeah. the day. Oh, like brushing your teeth or brushing your hair. <laughs> or fur. <laughs> that took us. Boy, Elmo wants to find out more about routines. Hey, let's ask Elmo's friend, Smarty. Let's call her together. Oh, oh Smarty! Smarty. <laughs> Here I am, answering your call. It's what I do every day as part of my routine. Well, that's perfect, Smarty, because Elmo wants to learn all about routines. Well, what do we do to learn something new? We, we look it up, up. searching. Here you go. There are lots of things that might be part of a morning routine. Things that you do every day, like eating breakfast, brushing your teeth, toothpaste, brush, rinse and spit, getting dressed. And once you're done with your morning routine, you're ready to start your day. Wow! Thanks, Smarty! You got it, Elmo. Well, I'm off to recharge my battery. Just part of my routine. <laughs> See ya! Bye bye! <laughs> Boy, that gives Elmo an idea. Let's play a game together. Come on! <laughs> this kid is going to brush her teeth as part of the morning routine. Let's try to put the pictures in order. What should she do first? Is it this? No, you put the toothpaste on your toothbrush. So this one comes first. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That comes first. So what comes next? Is it this? No. No, she has to brush her teeth before she spits it out. Right. She has to brush her teeth up and down and all and then she spits? Yeah, yeah, and then she spits. Oh, that makes sense. First, she yeah. puts the toothpaste on the toothbrush. Then she brushes, then she spits. That's it. That's the right order. Oh, yeah. It's important to do your morning routine in order. And that makes Elmo wonder even more. Does Mr. Noodle have a morning routine? Hey, let's ask him, okay? Hi, Hi Mr. Mr. Noodle! It's Mr. Noodle's brother, Mr. Noodle. Mr. Noodle, can you show us your morning routine? Mm -hmm. You know, do your routine. routine. The things you do every morning to get ready for your day. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, Mr. Noodle has his clothes. He's, He's going, going to get dressed. Now, not like that, Mr. Noodle. No, no, no. First, take your pajamas off. Then, put your clothes on. Yeah, there you go. That's, That's right. right. What does Mr. Noodle do next in his morning routine? Yes, you have breakfast. Is there something you do before you eat, Mr. Noodle? <laughs> uh, he is dancing. Is dancing part of the morning routine? It is for Mr. Noodle. <laughs> Bye, Mr. Noodle. Have a good morning. <laughs> Boy, learning new things makes Elmo so happy. It makes him want to dance. Come on. Happy, happy dance, dance. Happy, happy dance, dance. When we learn something new, we do that happy dance, dance. Let's see your happy dance. Today. Yeah! Those are the things that you do every morning to get ready. Yeah, we're glad Crystal remembered her morning routine. Yeah, because nothing's as much fun as going outside and playing with a ball. <laughs> Those fish. 
Uh -huh. Wait, Elmo never knew balls were so good at go fish. <laughs> See you next time. Bye. Abby, give me all your sevens. Oh, she is good. <laughs> Hello there. Today on Sesame Street, it is Betty Pie time. So it is time to get ready for bed. I am ready for bed. It... Whoops, I'd better try again. Now I am ready for bed. Oh, maybe not. Be right back. Now am I ready for bed? <gasps> yes, I am wearing pajamas. Are they not stylish and cute? Now come on, it is bedtime here on Sesame Street. ever after. <laughs> oh, hi. It's nice to see you. Just oh, hello. Just <laughs> what, just what, just what? Abby is sleeping over at Elmo's house tonight. Yeah, <laughs> and Nina is babysitting. Yay! <laughs> All right, guys, you need to start calming down now. It's almost bedtime. Okay, but, 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 but now can Elmo and Abby calm down? How, how, how? Yeah, we're too excited about our... <gasps> Coming down now. Don't you have a regular bedtime routine? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Um, what's a bedtime routine? Hmm. It's when you do the same things every night before you go to bed. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. Elmo does the same things every night before he goes to bed. Hey, uh, I do the same things before I go to bed, too. So you both have bedtime routines. <gasps> Great. That should help you calm down and get ready for bed. Yay! Yay! Bedtime routine! What do you do every night before you go to bed? Um, okay, okay, so, uh, oh, okay. Every night before Elmo goes to bed, Elmo brushes his teeth with his favorite toothbrush. <laughs> Me too. I better get my fairy toothbrush. <laughs> fiddle do and fiddle dee. Toothbrush, toothbrush, come to me. Yep, it brushes my teeth for me. That's kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, but first, I gotta catch it. Huh? Wait, what? <laughs> you have to catch your toothbrush? Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna get you, toothbrush. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Toothbrush is not a good way to calm down before bed. Uh, well, yes, it's not? not? No. Oh. Running around wakes you up more and gets you too excited to fall asleep. Oh, oh. but my fairy toothbrush always brushes my teeth for me. I mean, how am I supposed to get my teeth clean without it? Um, uh, well, maybe Abby could try brushing her own teeth like Elmo does. <gasps> good idea. That sounds like a calmer, quieter way to do it. <laughs> oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go, Abby. You want to try? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> I've never used a regular toothbrush before. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. Uh, well, Emma, we'll show Abby how. Oh, and you can, too. Come on, everybody. Let's show Abby how to brush her teeth all by herself. <laughs> okay, so first, first you hold the toothbrush like this, right? Oh, okay. And then you brush up and down okay. like this. <gasps> and then you brush all around, mm -hmm. like this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> nice brushing, everybody. Yeah, that was amazing. Uh -huh. Okay, I'm gonna try now. Your turn. Okay. okay, put my brush like this. Uh-huh. Up, down. Yeah. Uh, side, side. Uh, all around. Uh -huh. All around. <laughs> Work. Okay, now 
what's the next thing you do before bed? Well, next, Elmo always sleeps with his favorite soft, cuddly toy, Baby David. <laughs> well, me too. That's why I brought this flower pot. Uh, Bobby <laughs> sleeps in a flower pot. No, no, I need this here pot to put my seeds in. Seeds? What for? Well, to grow a beanstalk. <laughs> cool, a beanstalk! <laughs> How else can I get to the giant? Giant? Does Abby mean the giant from Jack and a Beanstalk? <laughs> yep, we're good friends. Are you ready, Mr. Giant? <laughs> ready, Abby. <laughs> <laughs> we play tug of war every night with a teddy bear to see who gets to sleep with it. You do this every <laughs> night before bed? Uh-huh. And tonight, I'm gonna win. Oh, no, you're not. <laughs> I am. No, I am. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Oh, hang on, you two. Playing tug of war is not a good way to calm down before bed. It's not? No, it, it gets you too excited. No. You need to do something relaxing. Oh, dear. Then I guess we better stop. You can have the bear tonight, Mr. Giant. Okay. Thanks, Abby. <laughs> night, night. But what will I do instead of playing tug of war? With the giant. Well, well, maybe Abby could do it Elmo does. Is it something that helps you calm down and relax before bed? Uh-huh. First, Elmo pats baby David on the head. <laughs> oh, and then Elmo gives baby David a hug. And then Elmo says good night to baby David. Good night, baby David. Good night, Elmo. That's lovely, Elmo. <laughs> Aw. Yeah, but I don't have a stuffed toy tonight. Um, oh. the, the giant has my teddy bear. Oh, right. Um, yeah. oh, okay. Well, what if Abby borrowed Elmo's elephant? Her name is Ellie. Oh, there you go. Thank you, oh, Elmo. You're welcome. Okay, so I'm gonna pat her on the head. <laughs> Give her a hug. Uh -huh. And night, night. <laughs> uh, there. Now does everyone feel calmer? Yeah, I do feel calmer. Oh, Elmo, too. Oh, so does baby David. <laughs> That's more like it. Now, what's the last thing you do every night before bed? Um, oh, Elmo listens to a lullaby. <gasps> Me, too. Oh. Oh, wonderful. I love lullabies. Oh, so do I. And this one is my favorite. Lullaby, lullaby, lullaby. <laughs> song to help you fall asleep before bed. Uh, well, I guess my fairy bedtime routine is not very good at calming me down. <laughs> no wonder it takes me so long to fall asleep. All right, well, don't worry, because tonight I'm going to sing you a lullaby that's guaranteed to make you feel calm and sleepy. <laughs> Off to bed. Oh. Uh, well, what kind of lullaby is Nina going to sing? It's one my mom used to sing to me every night when I was a little girl. Is it part of your bedtime routine? Yes. Snuggle down now. Okay. <laughs> Good night, my little ones. You've had a busy day. Now close your eyes and sleep. Tomorrow's on its way. <laughs> sleep tight, my little ones. Stay cozy in your beds. And dream your happy dreams, my little sleepy. Dream lots of happy dreams, my little sleepy heads. Buenas noches. Jump up, get down. Come dance with now. We're moving our body to the ABCs. Dance nearby. Wow. Dance far away. Now clap your hands. To the letter of the day, clap, clap. What's the letter? Clap, clap. What's the letter? Clap, clap. What's the letter? What's the letter? What's the letter? What's the letter? The letter of the day is B. It's the letter of the day. It's the letter of the day. It's the letter. It's the letter. It's the letter of the day. It's the letter of the day. It's the letter of the day. B. B is for bedtime. 
down. Hi, I'm Tracy, and I'm ready for bed. You know, a lot of bedtime things start with b b b, like bed, blanket, and boodles. My stuffed beagle. Night, night, boodles. Don't forget about me. Ah, a bear? Mm -hmm. What are you doing in my bed? Oh, I'm burrowing. Oh, okay. Well, bear does start with the letter B. Yeah. <laughs> so does banana. Whoa! <laughs> Could you scooch over? I don't want to get bruised. Okay. Uh, Basketball also starts with the letter B. And bounce! 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 Hey! Okay. Bounce. I'm bouncing! This beaver's trying to sleep! Beaver starts with the letter B. Yes, it does! All right. All right, everybody, settle down. Settle down. All right, all right. It's time for bed. Like I said, there's a lot of bedtime things that start with B. Don't forget me. Big bird? Big bird starts with B. Yes, it does. Mm -hmm. All right, good night, everyone. Good, good night. night. <laughs> oh. I need to get a bigger bed. It's time to get up and stomp your feet. Do this great foot stomping Transylvanian beat. Start nice and slow. One, two. Then speed up more. One, two, three, four. Then stomp away. One, Cause two, we're about three, to four, find out one, the number of the so day. What's the number? Stop, stop. What's the number? Stop, stop. What is the number? The number of the day rhymes with hen and pen. The number of the day is ten. So that's the number. The number, that's the number of the day. Ten. Now let's stomp ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> One. <laughs> two. <laughs> Three, <laughs> four, <laughs> five, <laughs> six, <laughs> seven, <laughs> eight, <laughs> nine, <laughs> <laughs> Smart Cookies, a tough batch of home-baked heroes. There's Figby, Misfortune, Chapowski, and Cookie Monster. Hello! Will the Smart Cookies catch the crumb? Find out now on Smart Cookies. Your Royal Majesty, I present the Smart Cookies! Smart Cookies, thank goodness you're here! <laughs> You must make sure that royal pain in my crown, the crumb, doesn't come in here and ruin my sleep. No worry, you kinginess. We make sure that no one keep you awake. Never you fear, your majesty. You can rest easy knowing the smart cookies are on the job. <laughs> Very well. Good night. All right, smart cookies. Let's all focus. And make sure that the crumb does not get into the king's bedroom. Right, the crumb! Mm -hmm. And he looked like what again? Oh, I had the image loaded on my small cookie tablet. Oh. Have a look. Nom, 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 nom. Hey, don't eat my small cookie tablet. Mm. Ah! Uh, okay, uh, oh yeah, me got it. Okay, that crummy crumb not get by me today. Whoa, 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 hey, wait, who are you? Me? Oh, uh, I'm uh, just a little bird here to sing the king a lullaby. Uh, tweet, tweet, uh, chirp. Wait a minute. Me got to make sure you, not the crumb. Me got to check picture. You have same hair as crumb. Uh, mm, you have same ears as crumb. Hey, 
Meeting you may be the crumb. Oh, don't be silly. Uh, I have a birdie beak. Tweet, 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 tweet. Oh, yeah, that's totally different. Okay, go sing lullaby. <laughs> the fake beak worked. Now I can keep the king awake with my newest and baddest baked good. <laughs> What's that snapping noise? The ginger snap. A cookie that will snap louder and louder until it breaks into a million crumbs. Oh, no. <laughs> I'll never be able to sleep with crumbs in my bed. Stop him. Oh, snap. Hey, who turned out the light? He's gagged. But where's the ginger snap? Oh, dear. This is a problem. Oh, wait. I'm getting a clue. The ginger snap is hidden inside something shiny? Me know something shiny. Ginger snap must be inside shiny tuba. Really? <gasps> ah! oh, you've got to find that cookie before it breaks into a million pieces. Oh, wait. I'm getting another clue. <laughs> The ginger snap is hidden inside something you put on your head. Me no. Oh, yeah. A bowling ball? You can't put a bowling ball on your head. Oh, sure you can. Yeah, watch. Yeah. Oh. Ta -da! Oh. Oh. I've been on the job long enough to know that to solve a problem, you gotta stop and think it through. It's getting louder. That cookie is going to break. Oh, this is so stressful. We got to have cookie to calm me down. <laughs> wait, wait, I'm getting another clue. <laughs> the ginger snap is hidden inside something that is worn by a king or a queen. Does that make sense to you? Wait, me no, me no. Oh, wait a minute. Me better stop and think it through. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, what's something that's shiny that you put on your head and that's worn by a king and queen? <gasps> Me know a crown. Ginger snap must be hidden inside king's crown. Crown a bunga! <laughs> nice jab, Cookie Monster. Yeah. But you still need to stop it before it breaks into a million crumbs. <laughs> oh, that easy. Curses! Oh, foiled again! But I'll get you next time, smart cookies! <laughs> Get him! Put your head down. Lie all the way down. 
I wonder if Mr. Noodle snores. That's good, Mr. Noodle. <laughs> oh, what's that, Dorothy? Oh, okay, okay. Dorothy wants to ask someone else. How do you go to sleep? This is my cozy bed, and every night I go to sleep in it. But I never go to sleep without my favorite teddy bear. And this is how we do it. Good night, Dorothy. Hi, Dorothy. I'm Joey. Hi, Dorothy. I'm Nikki. We sleep in bunk beds. I sleep on the top. I sleep on the bottom. Good night, Dorothy. Good night, Dorothy. Oh, boy! Everything's asleep today. Hey, wake up, TV! Wake up! Elmo knows what to do. Welcome to the Sleep Channel Must Sleep TV. You give us 22 minutes, we'll give you a very nice nap. Today's feature, the girl who loved to sleep. Oh. Once upon a time, there was a girl who loved to sleep. I love to sleep. One night, she fell asleep and dreamed that she was flying high up in the sky. Whee! But instead of clouds in the sky, there were ice cream cones. All flavors. Wow! And her cat, Rocket, was riding on a motorcycle. Rocket! And she woke up. Rocket, what a racket! Purring in my ear. Now go to sleep! She went back to sleep and dreamed that she was sliding down a big slide. Whee! And she landed in a big sea of bubbles. Wow! And her cat, Rocket, floated by on a bubble. He had a big mustache. Rocket. Then, all of a sudden, she had a big mustache. Wow! It tickled her, and she woke up. <laughs> Rocket, your tail. Now go to sleep. So she fell asleep again and dreamed her cat, Rocket, was chasing a mouse. Hey, that's not my dream. That's Rocket's dream. Anyway. The girl and her cat dreamed happily ever after. The end. Open up, please. Thank you. Look! Wow! <laughs> How about talking to a bed? I mean, I'm where it all happens. You tell him, Betty boy. Wow! A bed and pillow. <laughs> and don't forget the covers on top and me, the mattress underneath. Yeah. You tell him, Betty boy. <laughs> Warm and comfy. Uh-huh. Forty winks with me, and you'll be feeling good as new. Huh? Sleep! It helps you stay healthy and gives you energy. Mm. You tell him, Betty boy. Wow! Nighttime, daytime, anytime's a good time to hit the sack. Could you keep it down, please? I got someone napping here. Oh, sorry. Not all birds sleep in nests, you know. Flamingos sleep standing on one leg. Dorothy's imagining Elmo as a flamingo. Oh, sleeping on one leg. <sighs> and bats sleep hanging upside down. Elmo needs to get a grip. <laughs> We're gonna sing. A sleep lullaby. Oh, and you can sing too. Here we go. Sleep, 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 sleep. I like to sing too. Okay. Sleep, 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 sleep,
on and move your body and use your mind Cause you know you are growing all the time You're getting smarter Caring and caring every day. You're getting smarter, stronger, 